Hi, I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this news every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, Space Runners, a metaverse fashion brand, raised in MCO led by Polychain and Pantera Capital. XL and Jump Crypto participated in the round, as did angels like Animoca Brands chairman Yet SIU and Twitch co-founder Justin Khan. The fresh funding will be used to create high fashion and prestigious wearables in the virtual world so that users can dress their avatars in the latest trends. Space Runners launched its first NBA Champions sneaker collection in December, and now it plans to debut the fashion in the metaverse collection that is built on the Ethereum blockchain. Space Runners fashion metaverse is called the Spaceverse, and it will come with its own digital currency. See? We told you sneakers are the hottest trend. News source, Coindesk, the last decade in plus size fashion easily outpaced the previous 20 to 30 years. In spring 2020, 86 curve models walked across all four fashion capitals, but as shows got smaller and brands opted out of fashion week during the pandemic, those numbers plummeted. There's been some representation, models like Paloma El Cicer and Precious Lee walking for major European luxury houses and Lizzo ringing up Donatella Versace for custom gowns. But for the most part, fashion remains close to most plus-sized people. The next generation of plus-sized fashion brands aren't on the runways, they're on TikTok. Now, indie designers who didn't have the funds or connections to court traditional gatekeepers can appeal directly to their target audience if you can go viral, that is. News source, Fashionista. A computer chip brain implants were viewed as the worst AI technology for society in a Pew Research Center survey about the rise of AI. The center surveyed 10,260 U.S. adults about six AI human enhancement technologies, which were facial recognition, social media algorithms, robotic exoskeletons, brain chip implants, driverless cars, and gene editing. Respondents were the most concerned about brain chip implants that could help humans process information faster. 56 said it was a bad idea for society. On a personal level, 80 said they would not want a brain chip implant, like those being developed by Elon Musk's Neuralink, even if it was available. However, 77 said they would support brain implants in medical applications, for example, by restoring movement for paralyzed people. News source CNN. In a new paper, researchers from Duke University describe a system called iSyn that makes analyzing a person's eye movements easier than ever before. Instead of collecting huge amounts of data directly from human eyes, however, the researchers trained a set of virtual eyes that mimic real eye movements. The system is fed templates for typical eye movement patterns such as reading text, watching a video, or talking to another person and then learns to match and recognize those patterns in actual humans. In other words, the system uses example data to guess what a person is doing or looking at based entirely on their eye movements. Researchers are building new ways to track and analyze your every glance and big tech platforms like Facebook are already looking to make their own. News source, Vice a thriving economy for Discord grinding has emerged on freelance services marketplace Fiverr. For as little as five an hour, freelancers will chat, moderate, and perform tasks in the Discord of your choice of service Critical and DAOs, which operate almost exclusively on the platform. A huge use case for Discord grinders is to work to get whitelist spots on hyped NFT projects. The freelancers will complete these time-intensive tasks on your behalf, giving you a shot at the whitelist. The new role is viewed by some as a new way for people many of whom live in developing countries, to make money in the emerging Web3 economy. Critics say Discord grinders are different than traditional community managers and can hurt the integrity of the DAO. News source, Decrypt, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360 Fashion. Knit podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode. Get to subscribe.